Hey guys, it's Habib. So it's raining outside, so I'll do the video right here. I know you guys like sweet emotional stories that touches your heart, and so do I. About three days ago, I went all the way to the city to look for a heart-touching emotional story for you guys. So while going to the city, I saw this young homeless dude, he looked like my age and I really wanted to know his story. Excuse me, hi, how are you? I'm Habib, nice to meet you. So I approached him and I told him I'm a vlogger. I'm a vlogger, I'm just recording New York City. He was totally okay with me recording him. Just give me one second. Do you mind if I'm putting my camera right here? Yeah. What's your name, by the way? Chuck. Chuck? Yeah. Oh, nice name, Chuck. So I was talking to him for a while and then I told him I'm kind of hungry just to see his reaction and this is what he did. And that wasn't the craziest thing he did. Uh, did you eat anything today? Not really, I haven't eaten anything. Oh, really? Yeah, kind of. I mean, I got this bag of chips you have, man. I mean, people give me food all day long, so. This bag of chips? Yeah. You don't mind? No, not at all, no. Really? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, you oh, sure? Yeah, I'm positive. What are you gonna eat? Somebody will give me something. <laughs> I took the bag of chips and I was about to leave to see what else would he do and what he did was just unbelievable. I don't want to bother you anymore. No, I'll just, I'll, I'll, okay. I'll just take a... No, I mean, listen, I don't... People, I have nobody, you know what I mean? I have no family. You have no family? Nothing. So I'm here all alone by myself. So I'm here. You can hang out and talk to me if you want, man. In fact, I'll leave you. I'll leave you just to just hang out. You're gonna pay me to talk to you? Yeah, he offered me money just so that he could spend some time with somebody. First I was like, why would he do such a thing? And then I found out about his story, which was heartbreaking. Really, really heartbreaking. What happened to your family? Uh, I was raised in the house, okay? Really? I'll show you a picture of my nephew. This is my nephew right here. <laughs> Let's go. Do you remember anything about your family? Uh, I jumped around a lot. So. Just from families to families? You never saw your real parents? Wow. I mean, I know about them, but I never You know about them? They don't want to contact you? Why not? Why did they give up? You would rather have people talk to you than give you money? You can put your contact information if you want to. You know, it's not a lot. Uh, I want you to take care. Chuck, right? Yeah. Habib. Yeah, they call me Habibi. Okay. You know what that means? Like a, it's not like a Habibi store or something? <laughs> After meeting Chuck, I realized something about people. Many of us have families, but we tend to not associate with them because we don't want to be near our family. But this guy here, he doesn't have a family, but he wants a family. So if you have like a family member that you don't like, try giving them a second chance. Because family is like the most beautiful thing you could ever have. And you don't want to lose that. And once you lose it, it's gone. And I'm not gonna tell you to share this video or give this video a like today. I'll just leave it up to you whether you wanna share it or like it. And I'll see you tomorrow, Sunday. I have a really funny video for you guys, so I'll see you tomorrow. Keep smiling.